I could take U.S. for like 15 years there, right? And, and uh, not really been successful. Um, Vietnam was the big one. Uh, sort of first started modern guerrilla tactics. Uh, I listed the population for current Vietnam. Of course, that's North and South now. Uh, 91 million, 128. But obviously, when we were fighting, we were fighting on behalf of the South, and the North was a significantly less population, so more like what you saw in Iraq or whatever. Um, pretty dense, so it should have been pretty controllable, um, other than the jungles and the tunnels and all the other stuff. But basically, we did a 15-year war from like 1960 to 1975. Kind of left there with our tail between our legs, and immediately the North took over the South, and now it's the Socialist Republic of Vietnam. Uh, and we haven't gone back, and uh, so kind of a loss there. So we, basically the U.S. couldn't really invade any of those three um, with that population, and neither could the Soviets and neither could the British, right? So looking at the, the military side of things, again, the, the big invaders in this particular scenario were the U.K., Russia, and U.S.A., and U.K., you know, 65 million people, pretty dense.